Hey guys, back at the 1800s house, different one. Um, just stepped out of my vehicle, literally ground balance the machine, walked two feet. And I got, it sounds like a nice quarter signal, jumping way up. So I guess I'll dig it. <coughs> Might be tough digging right here because it's going to be all compacted from the cars that go in here. Yeah, this is way too hard to dig, but I'll get back to you guys, let you know what it is. So it looks like it was a small button. I don't know if I can get the lighting right here, but... Looks like it was uh, maybe some type of mother of pearl in there. Anyhow, get back to you at the next one. Bye bye. Alright, I got a 76 here, right in front of the old uh, garage here. Let's see if we can do this one. A little bit easier digging right here. the old shovel ringing in there. That might be a good sign. Yeah, still in the hole. I'm hoping this is a weedy or an Indian. Found a lot of them here. That should be out of the hole now, unless it's super deep. I'm liking that. Let's see what's in the bottom of the hole here. It's like a piece of old brick down in there. Not seeing anything sticking out of the edge. Sounds like it's ringing right in the center there. I gotta widen the hole a little bit. See if that did anything. Nope, it's still in there. It just rained last night, so I might be able to pick up some of these deeper targets. Still ringing in really good. I'm not seeing anything though. Well, I might have just scratched whatever that was. Alright, I'll get back to you guys. I gotta dig this real deep, I guess.
Take it easy. It's just really, really deep junk. Ringing in like a weedy or a Indian head. <laughs> oh well, I'll get back to you guys. Back again guys, been toughing it out in the heat, sweating like crazy, and I just got uh, 1910 Weedy, I don't know if you can see that, super psyched about this, I mean I have hit this yard over and over and over again, and I just keep finding stuff. Goes to show, don't give up. But I won't be hitting this house for too long because it is going up for sale. And so I've been trying to hit it even harder. <laughs> Anyhow, I'm super excited about that. Been here about an hour and didn't really find much else. Alright, I'll get back to you if there's anything else in this hole. Take it easy. Bye. Of course, I never get this live, guys, but... I can't believe it. Right here, there's a bunch of signals, and this is a first for me. Been metal detecting for, uh, I think this is year two now. And look, we've got broken pottery. This could be a stash of rama. I just found a V nickel, my first ever V nickel. I don't know if you can see that. I know, don't rub it, don't rub it. I don't know if you can see it. I don't know if I'll get a date off that either. Anyhow, let me get this to the car. I got a 1910 wheat right there, moved right over here. And yeah, pretty excited. <laughs> yeah. All right. I can't really stick with it more today. Um, got some other things to do, but man, I gotta get back here somehow, try to figure out maybe how to mark this spot because I think there is more in the hole here. Or maybe right next to it, but that rings right in at 51. And it was pretty shallow, maybe five inches. Anyhow, there she be. Take it easy, guys. Till the next time. Bye bye.